Hey guys, I didn't plan on recording a video today, but I've just had this turn up in the mail with a pop in it. And it really, really upsets me. So like, let's, let's check out what's in it and what condition it's arrived in. Oh, who sends a Funko Pop in a plastic bag? I, it's just got no support at all. I must also point out, for those of you that follow me over on Instagram, this is not the same package as I showcased with the caved in bottom that also arrived. Uh, this is another day and another disaster as far as I'm concerned. On a plus point, well we can see first of all it's got very sunny, but it is easy to open. <laughs> so let's, let's try and get some sort of positivity out of it. Well, they've at least wrapped it reasonably well with their handle with care tape. If you're going to go to the bother to stick in lots of handle with care tape on a bag and on the packaging, take some bloody care and put it in a box. I feel like I'm going to rant and I've not even seen what condition the pop's in, so I'm going to stop. Let's get the, the bubble wrap open and then we can talk about it. So, as expected, top battered in. The seam uh, for the flap to go in is taped but also all crushed, big crease along the front, big crease on the bottom, bottom's fucked. Ah, uh, this is going to turn into a proper rant, so I'm going to try and stop, control my rage. Big crease across the side here, uh, where the, the kind of graphic of the, the pop or the client is. Uh, another big crease, as a matter of fact, you can see the box is kind of, well, you might not be able to see this, but squished underneath. What the actual fuck, seriously, if you're selling pops, fucking look after them and wrap them properly if you're going to be selling them. I'm fizzing, so I'm going to stop this video. Okay. I've calmed down. A bit. This was meant to be one of the last few pops that I needed for my Mandalorian line and actually I think what upsets me the most about it is this purchase was actually from quite a large popular retailer but through their eBay store compared to their website I'm, I'm not gonna name and shame them because I don't think that's really fair and I have opened up a return request for it maybe <laughs> in the future I'll talk about it more, but this was the client from the Mandalorian. I'm not even going to take it out of the box. And this is quite another depressing video. And for someone like myself that does make a reasonable amount of purchases from eBay, I feel like in the last four weeks, it's really taken a turn for the worst for me that I've never experienced this quality of shite that I have had of late uh, at least from a packaging perspective double check the listing when I stepped away there new is how it's dubbed it might be new when it left them but it's not new when it's come to me this is fucked and I'm not gonna keep it I don't really have anything more I can say about this other than I'm pretty sad don't forget guys it seems bizarre asking you to like this video but if you have enjoyed my pain Give me a thumbs up, leave me a note in the comments below to cheer me up. I'm Alistair and I'll see you guys for another unboxing video that's hopefully a lot more enjoyable than this in the near future.